Word for the Day Philippians 2 verses 3 to 5 Don't be selfish, don't try to impress others. Be humble, thinking of others as better than yourselves. Don't look out only for your own interests, but take an interest in others too. You must have the same attitude that Christ Jesus had. Reflection and Meditation, Selfish to Selfless Our default setting is selfishness. Don't believe it? Try hanging out with a toddler for a day. Toddlers want what they want, and they want it now. Toddlers will fight, and sometimes bite, to maintain dominion over their prized possessions. Toddlers have little concern for schedules, agendas, or perfectly white walls. The good news about toddlers in general is that they have the capacity to change into selfless person as they grow. But, if toddlers aren't lovingly redirected and taught how to consider others, that selfishness will continue. So, if we're naturally self-centered humans, how do we train our minds not to default to selfishness? The Bible encourages us to model our lives after the Lord Jesus. Do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit. Rather, in humility value others above ourselves, not looking to our own interests, but each of us to the interests of the others. In our relationships with one another, have the same mindset as the Lord Jesus Christ. Philippians 2 verses 3 to 5. The Lord Jesus didn't leverage his authority for personal advantage power, pleasure, control, or comfort, but took on the nature of a servant. The Lord Jesus spent his time investing in others. The Lord Jesus focused his attention on helping others. The Lord Jesus gave up his own life for others. If we find ourselves becoming self-obsessed, self-indulgent, or even a little self-righteous, consider asking God for his help. Ask him to help us see people the way he does. Ask him to use any knowledge we gain to love him and serve others. Ask him to put opportunities in our path to lead others toward him. The Word of God, the Holy Spirit, and relationships with other believers are what refines our hearts. And with God's help, we can change our tendency from living selfishly into living selflessly. Prayer to please God is to put others first. Let us pray. Our Lord and our God, you showed us what true humility looks like. You gave up everything to serve and save us. It shows your humbleness to God the Father, yet it was your precious blood which you sacrificed that paved a way for all of us to experience fresh and a new life. Thank you, Lord. Lord, today, please replace our pride and arrogant with humility. Replace our selfishness with selflessness. Change the way we think, talk, and act by putting others first, instead of ourselves with self-gain and wrong motive. Help us do it in a healthy way that honors you. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, we pray, Amen.